one time. Uh, Damien Lewis's wife had been visiting. She, they, they lived in London. The, uh, he, he, he plays yeah. your husband on exactly, the show. Exactly, Brody. Mm -hmm. um, and she'd been visiting from London. She went home and left. And uh, he opened his bag one day after he got home from work, and he found, like, a lacy black thong in there, mm -hmm. called her up and was like, honey, thank you. It's so sweet of you to leave a little something behind for me, so I'm thinking about you. And she was like, I'm sorry, what? What are you talking about? Oh, no. He's like, uh, the, in my bag? She's like, mm, don't know what you're talking about. He's like, you know what, never mind. We'll, we'll talk later. Um, he looks closer at the thong, and it has my initials in it. <laughs> okay, I know what you're thinking. <laughs> yeah, of course you know what we're thinking. <laughs> but it turns out that the wardrobe person who was setting up his room had my stuff there, too, and dropped it in his bag accidentally. But it could have caused a big stir. It, it, yes, yeah. <laughs> this happens with our, at our wardrobe all the time. <laughs> My I wife is always have... finding Andy's thong. <laughs> it it, it I says mean, A R. A mistake. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how they got there. You. Uh... Uh, Homeland just <clears throat> won the Golden Globe. Congratulations. Thank you it must so have been really much. exciting. You went to the Golden Globes and uh, looked. Stunning. Thank you so Stunning. much. I think we have a photo of you at the Golden Globes, and you look oh, absolutely really? beautiful oh. there. And Thank I'm curious, you. had you been to the Golden Globes before? Uh, no, never to the actual event. I've been to the parties, but never to the event. And it was amazing. You know, incredible to see all these actors that you grow up watching all in the same room. I had, um, can I brag a little bit? Sure. Um, Morgan Freeman came up to me and said, I was tempted to step on the train of your dress just so I could talk to you. Oh, my God. I melted. I was just like, well, you're... Talking to me now? Yeah. <laughs> it's the guy from the Penguin voiceover. <laughs> I was drawn naturally to the train of your dress. Uh, wow, that's incredible. And then uh, what about the parties afterwards? Did you, did you go to those? We did. We hit some parties. And then the cast was kind of traveling in a pack. Um, we went to one party and we're trying to get in. Uh, and they were like, do you have tickets you know, for the party? And we're like, oh, well, you know. Somebody goes, it's OK. It's the cast of Homeland. They just won a Golden Globe. And they're like, Okay, do you have tickets? Yeah. And we're looking around like, what? And Claire's publicist is standing there with Claire. They have the Golden Globe. And we're like, we have the Golden Globe! You could buy those anywhere. <laughs> I have like 10 Golden Globes in my glove compartment. They were formerly bowling trophies. You can't use them for anything. No. Well, true story is uh, the second time I hosted the Emmys, I, I finished the Emmys. People were like, good job. And I was walking into the after party. Guy stops me, puts his hand on my chest. You can't come in. And I said, I just hosted it. And he went, where's your ticket? Couldn't have a ticket. And I was, for 45 minutes, I was like trying to get in. And when I got there, all the shrimp was gone. <laughs> Only in LA. Only in LA, okay. Um, I hope I didn't creep you out by personally booking you on this show and making you come here. Yeah. And having your pants fall apart. <laughs> it was an accident.